hey guys welcome on in now today we are going to talk about fishing now my fishing skill isn't the highest and uh we're actually sitting here in the pet store because i'm gonna need to buy some fish food and we'll talk about that a little bit later in the in the video where you can put your fish into the aquarium but let's just talk about fishing as a whole and it's just really just a fun thing to do so um hopefully this is a short and sweet video if you guys can hit that like and subscribe let's get started all right welcome on in guys here i am at the artificial island i don't know why i'm here it's uh it, it's just because i like i like fishing in this area you can fish anywhere just as a heads up you can literally fish everywhere in this game you want to go down to uh the abyss you can there's fish here there's fish in any anywhere that there is actual water i have the zone over there for you to see it there's fish in the abyss there's fish in the new areas there's literally fish everywhere now just the general basics of fishing if we go into our fishing guide here you'll see that we have a rod you can buy this rod uh your first uh set of gear uh which is just a rod and bait you can get by using a little bit of money buy your rod and then you'll buy some bait now in the top right hand corner i know this is in chinese but um you'll see that i have about 245 left of bait i can buy so if i was to buy one piece of bait right now that's how many fishes you can do you cannot fish without bait so I get that many per week now when this did launch you were only able to do about 20 a day so the only thing i can think of is that this stacks over time so just just keep that in mind uh while you're going for fish so the general basics of fishing is you can go to any pool um now i like to go to these circle pools and we'll talk about that in a second uh you can go to any pool here and then you can just start fishing now i'm going to make sure i have the right rod on i have the right fish food on this is actually called tiger eye uh, fish food because this pond actually has tiger eye fish in there. Then you hit one just to start fishing. After a couple seconds, some fish will bite on the pole. There, you can see there's a rare fish right there. Hopefully we don't get that. And then on the left-hand side, it shows you how much you need to keep this in line to be able to catch the fish. You see it's nine out of 14. I'm pressing A and D to keep that cursor inside of this little bar. And on the right-hand side is the tension. Now the tension is when your line does snap and you can't pull the fish in any longer. The better the rod, the better the tension. And in order to catch rare fish, you're really going to need a better rod. So don't worry about catching like rare fish in the beginning because it's not really going to matter. Okay. So going back into fishing here, you can see I have many different types of baits. Um, these baits are for different pools. If you were to go to the map, uh, I, once again, I know this is in Chinese, but on this specific pool, this one actually has red tiger eye, uh, or actually, let me make sure I'm reading that right, red eye fish. So what you can do here is you can actually use the correct bait, and there's different baits, and some of them are very straightforward, where the baits actually give you, uh, they'll actually be the same name. So sometimes you'll use blue bait, sometimes you'll use uh, purple bait. Now, you need to be able to get these coins, and the way you do that is by selling your fish. Now, if we go to our members here, and go through any of our tabs we can actually go to any of these fish here and we can just hit recycle these are worth 200 a piece i just made 3200 now you're like oh do you really have to sell your fish i wouldn't worry about selling your fish um unless they're in this first tab here from uh, what i uh, understand is that those are the those are the, the fresh fresh fish fish and if they're in the first tab they allow you to put them in your aquarium and i'll go to the aquarium in a second and talk about that so anything that's uh, in these two tabs and below, you can sell it. And you're going to need a lot of coins anyways, because buying um, buying your fishing rods are very expensive. So if we go into the store here, you can see you can see we have a rank. I'm level three. I'm about to hit level four. Um, and if we go into the store here, we can see that there are many different unlockable uh, things you can buy. Here's the next fishing rod, which is what I really need to start getting some rare fish. You can't really get fresh rare fish before this this blue one uh, unless you get super lucky and then you'll have uh, a purple rod and then a gold rod there are some accessories that you put on like a new fishing hat and some new chat bubbles and some new eyeglass wear not the not the biggest fan of it but you know it is what it is so the other thing i do want to point out is that you whenever you go to any of these areas or um if whenever you go to any of these areas they'll have this general board and it'll tell you the time frames that these pools are live on so if i was to click on this it would tell me hey that pool over there 
is still active, you can go over there and try and get those rare fish. All right, so the exciting part about fishing is one, you actually get black crystals from that. Whenever you catch new fish, you get some, you get some black crystals. It ranges anywhere between five to 20, I believe, depending on the rarity of the fish. Maybe, maybe super rare fish are actually 50. I've never actually caught one. And now you can go to your aquarium, which your aquarium is in your new apartment. So let's go ahead and speed run over there. All right, here we are in our apartment, which is which is what you're going to get in version 2.2. Now you can have cats and ducks and a bunch of other things, but you can also put your fish in this aquarium. Now, once again, it's really hard to get those rare fish in the beginning of the game, so it'll take time. And you're going to be able to put up to four fish at a time into this aquarium. Now, you do have to keep the fish fed, and this does actually so if you log off the game for days on end you need to make sure you stockpile this food otherwise you will be in a lot of trouble where do you get the food you may ask well we were at the pet store earlier and here we are at the pet store in the pet store you'll find this vendor and this vendor sells uh, a variety of different pets it also sells cat litter cat food dog food i believe dog litter grass uh i think that's for your for your duck if you bought a duck and then you have fish food as well so just make sure that when you are taking care of your pets that you do have the proper amount of fish food you will have to spend mira on this so if you're still clearing out gotcha ponds maybe you don't want to fully invest in your house and then secondly if you do go on vacation for too far of an extended period of time there's a good possibility you're going to lose your pets that's all i've got i hope you guys enjoyed the video and um, I'll see you guys out there fishing at uh, Live 2.2. If you guys can't hit that like and subscribe once again, and you can't see me, but uh, fist bump from me to you.